This song has a story behind it. There was a prophet in Zimbabwe many years ago. His name was Chami Nuka, and one of the stories about Chami Nuka was that he disappeared into the ocean for nine months. And when he came back, he came back with medicines that were shown to him by the dolphins and the whales, and he also came back with the Mbira, this instrument I play. Part of the legend. So the other day, I was in Maui, and uh, there were some whales offshore that we could see. And I got the crazy idea that I should go play for them. <laughs> and actually, the beer that I'm playing right now was the one that I took out on a little teeny surfboard. I strapped it to my back. And I paddled out into the middle of where the, the uh, whales were. And I placed the uh, beer uh, on the uh, surfboard and tried to float and play at the same time. And I played this song because this is Chami Luka's song. I thought there might be some memory that would be sparked into the whales. Well, just as I started playing, six of them came out of the water and jumped out, you know, I'm sure you all have seen that living here and everything. To me, on a six foot two surfboard, it was a little overwhelming. And, uh, <laughs> I did my best to try to keep playing. The rest of the story is not very courageous, but I'm gonna tell it to you anyway. <laughs> They came in very, very close. In fact, suddenly one rose, like right where you people are here, like rose right out of the water, right in front of me. And I suddenly realized my smallness. And although I like to consider myself a pretty spiritual person, I jumped on that surfboard and I paddled back to shore as fast as I could. <laughs> Not a very heroic story, but a true one. Somebody's got to come and tell the truth. The truth. The truth, yeah. I heard the whales singing the truth. I was under that deep blue sea and I I heard some whales singing the truth Ah yeah, somebody, somebody's got to come Somebody's gotta come and tell the truth